Bienvenue et bonjour à tous. Welcome everyone to Canadian Tire Center and thank you for joining us this morning. We're here today to announce that we're renewing our longest standing partnership with Molson Coors Canada for another five years. Molson Coors has been a continuous partner of ours since the team began play back in 1992. In fact, Molson came on board as an original partner of the hockey club even before we had a team. Without a doubt, Molson Coors has been our most ardent supporter and committed partner ever since. As well as working closely with us on community programs, Molson Coors has also been a leader in helping us create unique social neighborhoods here at Canadian Tire Centre. Whether that be the Molson Brew Pub or Molson Canadian Hockey House. And now Molson Coors will be continuing these efforts as we're happy to announce today as part of our extension we'll be creating the new Molson Canadian Fan Deck. Be a new space located between sections 214 and 216 and it will be ready for opening night. As the name applies, the new Molson Canadian Fan Deck will be a gathering place for our fans. It will feature a large social and interactive bar area that will be open to the general public and will be accessed from our main concourse. And as we move into 2017, we'll of course be celebrating 25 years of Senators Hockey here in the nation's capital. And it's fitting today that we'll be announcing that as part of our renewal with Molson Coors, they are the first presenting partner of the Sens 25 celebrating our, 25, our 25th anniversary. Uh, very proud of the 25 years that we've been sponsors of the Sens. And of course, uh, very pleased to be the first of the partners to have the chance to come up here and just talk about uh, what the sponsorship means to us. And so Molson, at Molson Canadian, we're, we're super happy to have the chance to be part of hockey at the NHL level, and of course, even more happy to be part of the game at the team level. The five-year partnership with the Sens is a chance for us to take the game up, to do things that are more exciting. And so I'm thrilled to see this fan deck coming to, to uh, the arena, the Sens arena, because what you're going to see is actually the most prized place to, to, to watch hockey is going to be at that fan deck. So Cyril, thanks to you and the team, I think it's really going to be a great, uh, great addition. I'm very excited to have renewed the agreement. I'm pleased that, that we're going to be continuing a 25-year history with the Sens. I'm thrilled to see what is going to go on inside the arena, and I know that the hockey experience for the fans who come here is going to be nothing short of tremendous. So if I had a beer in my hand, I would cheers all of you, but I'll just have to simulate that and say cheers anyway. Thanks for having me, and look forward to a great hockey season. Go Sens. Yeah, so there's, uh, there's 168 seats, 14 loges, and two, two suites. It's part of the space. The third deck, right? It's in the second, 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 level, second level, so it'll be the second level. Okay. Yeah. Accessed off the main concourse. And sorry, so it's going to be open to who? Just to, to, to general, a general public, but you can buy a season ticket in the space. And as I said, uh, about half the seats are already sold for the, for the current season. How is this different from any other seat that's out there? Can you explain the differences? Well, I mean, it's got the, it's got the space in behind it, so it's quite a large uh, interactive area. So it'll be, uh, be a bar area with, with the TV sets, uh, a lounge area. There'll be in-seat service in the space as well. And it's, it'll be connected right to the food area as well. So if you wanted to, to, uh, to access food, there's close, close by. So where does this idea come from? It's a number of different uh, buildings. Uh, you know, we've been studying throughout the throughout the league, and last year with the success of Club Bell, uh, we had a, you know, I think it was a real big success for us. And the only the only negative we heard was from the guys that were on the second concourse saying, "How about something like this for us?" And and it's, uh, it's been good that we we're able to do this in, in a partnership with Molson. You know, we we're still committed to you know to the long term to being downtown, but you know that's going to take some time, and we need to continue to invest in the building here and then into a. Uh, activities and initiatives for our fans so we think this is a good one uh, it's also I think uh, helps us stay current with the current trends in the, in the league and in sports and entertainment and will be a bit of a, a testing ground for a new arena as well if, if this really works out then maybe there's there's more of these spaces in, in a new building